Okay. So determine the point of intersection between two lines. Oh, between a line. Again, de determine the point of intersection of a line and a plane. So this is what we will do in this situation. So write parametric equation. Equations for the line. Well, it is easy in this case because you see, well, the, this is the point, this is the parallel, so x will be negative 2 plus 2t, y would be 2 plus 0t, well, I don't write any t then there, z is going to be 1 plus t. This is step 1. Step 2 is plugging those equation into the equation of the plane. So plugging the parametric equation into the equation of the plane. So it means that, well, for x you put so let me just write the equation for uh, the plane. And for x, you put negative 2 plus 2t. Two this is all multiplied by 2. Minus, for y, we put uh, 2. And for z, we put 1 plus t. This will give us an equation in T. So step three is that solve the equation for T. So this means that we have negative four plus four T minus two plus five plus five T is equal to 26. This is 9t, and this is negative 6 plus 1 minus 1 is all, oh, is equal to 26. And 9t is equal to 26 plus 1, which is 27. And t will be 27 over 9, which is 3. What we found here is the parameter. Now, this is the last step. Use the t, which is t equal to 3, uh, or plug in t into the parametric equation. In parametric equations, and find the components. And find the components of the point. So uh, let me make it a little bit smaller here. So x is negative 2 plus 2 times 3. y is 2. And z is 1 plus 4t, you plug in 3. So this will give me 6 minus 2 is 4. This is 2 and this is 4. So the point of intersection is the first component is 4, the second component is 2, the third component is 4. So these are the steps you need to take when you're working with uh, trying to find the intersection uh, point of a line and a plane. Okay, any question, any comments here?